I do. Right, I guess this is a Sheldon quest. I'm gonna do it. Climb Towering heights. Towering heights. Was Let's it, go. Was the description climb and slide? Yep. <laughs> Slip and slide. I love Jiggle and pop. And I love to slide. We're going wag. Stop making a noise. What? Oh, what you gonna give me? A hero charger. Hip and hab. Shit. I got a sniper stage. I don't like the sniper, but then you went you quite into him. No, I'm not much of a sniper person. I like snipers in suiting games, it's just not in, not in Splatoon. I feel like the sniper rifle's not got a long enough reach in Splatoon. Mm. And it always kind of like irks me a little bit. Damn. Well, this is. There's also its position, where I think Splatoon 2 is like a rough and fast game when I play it. And that's just the style I like playing. But I've played other first person shooters as a sniper, and I'm quite partial to it. So that's when the, it's got a lot of. You can kind of stand still and watch your opponent. Yeah. Splatoon doesn't cater to that very well. Yeah, most certainly. It doesn't seem like very much of a campy game. Or game where. It There's definitely the camping on the online. Like, there's people who sit at points and just like shoot from far. Yeah. But, uh. Um, no. Oh, fuck. This music's really cool. Proper techno, isn't it? I'm surprised they didn't have any seasonal levels. But I suppose, really, in games, that's kind of overplayed. Seasonal? Yeah, like the Winter Lair Zone. I don't. I'm, like I'm happy for that. I mean, like. Yeah. To be honest, if anything, I prefer a game which actually sort of picks a style and then sort of explores as many options as they can. Yeah. So this one they've decided Metro Urban Rad Kids kind of feel. Yeah. Or like um, street Game street culture kind of thing. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Nice. Designed to it. Whereas. Um, but they had that in the first game, so it would have been nice if they like kind of done a little bit more. Yeah, maybe mixed it's it up. A little a bit. bit too similar with a few extra assets, in my opinion. Yeah, that's true. But, uh, but to be honest, it came out so soon after the original. It did. What? It's true. It's true. The stuff they did add was all like kind of gameplay stuff, and it's all very good gameplay stuff. Hmm. Um. And I mean, like just up the aesthetic slightly. Actually, on the note of like picking a star and just sticking with it as well. Fuck! <laughs> you fell. I did fell. I did fell indeed. Oh, and I'm back at the start here. Um, yeah, on the subject of like picking an aesthetic and just realizing it as best as you can. Um, another example of that is the first Crash Bandicoot game. Because it's all jungle stages, that. It's all set in the jungle. Uh, I thought that was. Quite nice because they give you like jungle ruins, they give you jungle forests, jungle tribe settings, um, all sorts of tribal stuff or jungle stuff, and it just works. This is like a cohesive theme. Damn it! I'm getting clumsy. You are. Yeah. I don't blame you though, because the sniper rifle is not the easiest thing to bring to a mover. Yeah. Because you don't get that much uh, mobility when you're like aiming it. Remember, you can swim and keep your charge with the sniper rifle. Oh yeah, that's something they added, isn't it? Yeah. I should try and remember that. Um, but yeah, just cohesive design. Like, actual intention and thought being put into exploring just like a single I feel like opposed to like having your obligatory like... I feel like uh, it, you have to make... that only works with games a certain length because it does stale, it makes it become stale. Unless they they've got a particular talent for doing that sort of thing, mm. um, and I do like the stuff they're doing with Splatoon. Um, but well, they've got... I was I was quite intrigued to see like maybe a, you working around an actual urban setting, mm. other than all being kind of disarrayed blocks, which I'm not necessarily against because I like the level format. Mm. But like walking a street level on a stage kind of thing and going through buildings and things like that. And tre like trepping up an old uh, uh, office building or something. Hmm. This is uh, this this bit is really cool. Like this mechanic of like skating and stuff is really cool. Yeah, shame I can't aim for shit. Yeah, I couldn't do it very well with a sniper rifle anyway. That's one. Where you're gonna be, not where you're going. Yeah. You don't need oh. it. Right, I, I can get it. Yeah. <laughs> Nice Worth it for all that one. You did it. Let's go. Probably could have gone back. We're 1,500, so we should upgrade that gun now. Yeah. We get out of this. Oh. 
you. So yeah, you as you were describing before, the sniper rifle going out to me. Um, that's just the way I play. Uh, it's going to be interesting to see how you go about it. Because this is interestingly the same as what I was doing, but you can you can actually shoot. I don't know if you can shoot that one there. Like that one up there. I don't know if you can reach him from here. Yeah, you can't. Mm. Oh my yeah, god, jump. It, it, oh god, they're having you. Nah, nah, they got me. It's pretty tricky. Yeah. Because there's actually like loads of snipers here. You can actually kill them all though, straight away. Can I? Yeah, you can go up the wall back behind you. Nope. This is the thing, they've got an idea, they, they've got good AI now, they can actually remember where you are. Well they shoot where your ink is, so they try to they try to take your resources out. It's a item. bit too slippery, you know, sometimes. I saw, I saw an item there, so that's how you can remember. Ah! Oh, oh no! Double KO! Oh no! Oh, I'm out! Fine. Oh no! Uh. Oh jeez, this is an easy game! This is just a kid's game. Yeah, from kids. Oh, that's the thing. I like this game more than what I've experienced in Mario Odyssey. Yeah, that's how long it's taken us to get round to this game. But let's it's, not get into that. It's got a. Uh... It's got a kind of thing going on in this one where it requires you to be completely aware of your surroundings. That's what it tests you on most. If there's a skill set that makes uh, that I feel like this game like really challenges you on, it's uh, being quite omni aware. Hmm. It, it's always wanting you to be aware of what's happening uh, with the enemies, well, also what's happening you. with your yeah. like location. And what's happening with your character? Because you've got lots of recharge things to think about on your character, as well as um, the location kind of moving and drifting around, destructible items, and then they often throw multiple enemies at you. Ah. And they give you very small platforms on this one. Yeah, it's very trying. Always, always my of, like, strongest element. No, I just wonder if that's what the ultimate solution. For fuck's sake! Oh, you're fine. <laughs> I don't know, I'm still mad. Hey, there's law. I'm still mad. You found it though, you found law. Fuck you! Shut up, mommy. I know, it's token. No. That's fine. It's nowhere near worth it. Uh, we'll jump back in on this one and you can like fade us back in. Okay, yeah. Well, Whoops. you got to accomplish and we got a ticket out of it. I got a ticket? Oh, yeah, I suppose. I don't know. Is it a ticket to ride? Maybe. Well, you you can always uh, do some online play. The ticket. Make some milkshakes or whatever it is. Milkshakes? Yeah, you know, the smoothies. They give you bucks. Oh, man. Did you see Kelly just get really well just then? What did she say? Uh, something along... Well, talking about her sister and just like how we used to count stars together and just being a little bit like... Oh, oh man, I'm sad I missed that. What is, that, what is that circle thing there? Are you meant to shoot those? Uh, shoot that them. thing there? No, right. I'll shoot that anyway, just... Okay. The, this thing. Yeah, are you meant to shoot them or...? I don't know. I guess so. Yeah, I guess you just shoot them. They're just there for extra, extra bubbles. Okay. You never upgraded any weapons. Whoa! Oh, this thing's moving. That's what those things are. They're like lights. Oh, like okay. lights. What the heck is that one? It's got like a jetpack. Twisted tentacle octo troopers. 
Uh, don't forget you've got sub weapons. You will use a lot of ink though. Uh, give me a book. Ah, get out of here. Octo snipers too. Jesus. Oh god. <laughs> Fuck, leave me alone! <laughs> oh Jesus! I don't like this. I mean, you have to jump to get that. Nasty handle. No, I didn't like it. It was hard. Like it was hard. It was, it was scary. Yeah. Maybe made me stress. Uh, it's making I, need, me I need my therapist. Where's my therapist? Let's go around. What's behind that grate before you do that? What's yeah. underneath that grate? Probably death. So we didn't get any uh we didn't get any uh We didn't get any law, we didn't get any sardinium. Yeah. Well, I was looking really hard for the law. <laughs> I don't know if you're being serious or not. It's really hard to tell sometimes. I was being unsarcastic. I'm never sarcastic, but people always think I'm sarcastic. It's a growing problem I have at work. Stop, stop being out. Stop being incorrect all the time. But I'm always right. No, oh, that's incorrect. Yeah, See? Is. Five more stars to go. I'm done. <laughs> she sang it. I don't think she's got the extra side of it. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! From Bitcoin. Get out of here, you slime skin. You spago. Get out of here, spago. You slime so, skin. What, what's the matter with your skin, man? What? I'm just covered in slime. Ugh, slime skin. Ugh, God, geez, get, get out of here, slime God, skin. That's disgusting. God, taking our jobs. Ah, bloody hell. Pad yourself down, man. You're like, you're shiny. You're shiny in the wrong light. No I one don't wants like to see it. that. No so, one asked what, for what that. What is that slime on you, anyway? Like, has anyone actually defined what that slime is? It's like gross, man. God, it's like a. Like an extra layer of skin, it's gross. Yeah. It's like it's you're like leaving a residue like everywhere a, you go, man. It's, it's like gross. a liquid epidermis. Yeah. It's like, what's that? Ah, oh, you can tell whenever you walk through the room because there's a slight trail of slime by, behind you. God, you can always tell when a slime has been around here. A slime skin. Yeah. From the greasy trails that leave on door handles. Oh, God, that's, that's the worst. Like, I always think the door's locked. They come over not, here just and they make slime. our women slimy, like their slimy skin. Oh my gosh. Look at those balls. They look kind of flowery. Octoballers. I don't think I killed them. Oh, I I'd have to be they... really precise by killing them. There you go. You can do that, but I think they spawn endlessly. Ow. Didn't like that. I think it might just be easier just to avoid them. Yeah, honestly. The thing is, they also seem to spread ink as well. They do. Uh, I noticed actually, you're quite a cautious gamer in relation to myself. He said as he took damage. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, I was going after that item, so it was yeah. it was for a reason. Yeah, but I notice you, you tend to wait for the next cycle, opposed to, uh, like, oh, this is the right cycle, and just go for it. I tend to wait for the opportune moments, yeah. Yeah. Which I, make, I feel makes for very safe and cautious gameplay, but also yeah. quite slow. So, like, you'll get things right the first time. I think that's better. Eventually. When you were saying you're being gutsy in the la just the last time I was playing. Hmm? Last time I was playing, you literally pointed out that I was being awfully gutsy. Um, <laughs> No. That wasn't the case. <laughs> That's exactly that, what that was not the case. I'm That's sure. Exactly right. what happens. Hundred percent no. Where are you going? What are you doing? Why are you running? Oh, balloons. I'm being pretty, pretty cautious right now, man. <laughs> You're so cautious. You're so cautious, so, box. So cautious. You never, so you never go for the wild card, box. What's with you? Yeah. Why are you never exciting? Why do you never make the audience go? <gasps> Or get excited or anything. You're just like, oh yeah, Box is doing the thing and he's making sure he finds it. Oh, Box again. is winning again. <laughs> winning, yeah, but it's taking him so long. <laughs> it's like the guy who, like, he's doing like a time trial around a race course and you're doing it cautiously. You're not touching the sides or anything, but you're going at like 30 miles an hour. Whereas I'm going at 60 
And I'm like, whoa, shit. He's coming on to like two of his wheels and he's just like going way too fast around some of these bends and he's almost skidding out. Like, who's, who's play do you think is oh, going to be more interesting to watch? Mine. Yours? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Are you sure? Are you sure you're more Oh, I did that so good. I think it just went wrong. Yep. Hey, man, I never stopped. Did you see me do those test of trials in Zelda? Uh, no. I didn't watch you play Great Zelda at all. And Great did any of our fans trials. watch that bloody Zelda thing? No, no one watched it because no, we it weren't doing Let's Plays at the time that game came out. Oh, Jesus. I don't know how that shot me. Yeah, I think he's got like the ability to shoot through walls. I think he's got angles on me. Yeah. How the hell did I cut myself? Right, okay, new topic. Right, um... Man, you're so good at video games, Box. No, I'm not going to talk to you. I'm not I'm not dick. talking to you about video games what? anymore. Sorry? I'm going to talk to you a new, about a new topic. Right, name right. your favourite colour of Skittle. Wait, we did this topic. Yeah, yeah. Um, I told you it was white. That's right. Like my skin. Yeah. Oof. <laughs> Wait, you're a white guy? Okay, no, right, box. name your favourite kind of uh, M&M. What's your favourite kind of M&M? White. Damn it! <laughs> okay, uh... What's your... Right, I need something which doesn't have like a skin to it. What's your favourite colour of jelly bean? Uh, white. <laughs> do you get white? You do! <laughs> jelly bellies, they're white. Some of them can be, anyway. So, that's coconut or like... But, oh, I do but like peanut coconut. butter. Yeah, those joking, are those... but I do like coconut. Yeah, it is. What, like actual coconut or yeah, like coconut, coconut jelly beans? Both. Yeah, they're both good actually. Um, oh, you get the toasted popcorn ones, which are nice as well. Jelly bellies are bad actually. I like jelly belly. Um, okay, right. This topic didn't go very far. Try harder. Um, well, I'm trying to sort of like get like more rapid topic it's popping up. So that we just constantly have ear space being taken up. Uh, oh, that's ear my theory. Space. Yeah, just take up ear space all the time so that when people are watching right, this. Here's my question. Did you see anywhere that might have had the um, the law when I was playing through that? Because you were paying much attention, I'm sure. No, I wasn't paying any attention. Oh, that really good run I just did. Uh, I, 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 was, I can't see anything. I was barely paying attention, and I don't think no. Yeah, well, when you know, when you rewatch it, you'll be really in awe. Oh, actually, that was another good line as well from the previous Let's Play. Shock uh, and awe. Shock and awe, no. Um, a good line. We had... Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Dekai Desu! That was huge. Sugoi! <laughs> oh. Okay. Sugoi! <laughs> Bang. Bang. Cool. Um, so... what? Okay, what's your favourite M&M? Like crispy, peanut, peanut uh, butter, well, peanut butter, chocolate? I'm a big fan of peanut butter. Just plain peanut butter. Yeah. Not peanut? I, I like peanut. You like peanut, but what about peanut I'm butter? Because you, you get like another one. Uh, it's kind of like a specific aiming point. Yeah, but I don't know why I'm shooting it. Why I did. Oh, right. Oh, right. I don't okay. know what I accomplished from shooting it. Yeah, I don't think. No, oh, yeah, that's the good line which I really liked from the previous Let's Play. At some moment, for some reason, you say, I don't know, I don't think. I thought that was. I've been sort of like just repeatedly saying that to myself for months since. I just do. Yeah. Which I think is just like a really charming line from yourself. It's a good one. <laughs> it's like maybe like this episode could be like the best bits of the previous. No, um, let's not blate ourselves. Oh come on, man! It's like you that, that's, that's that. what that's what basically being on the internet's all about. It's flating yourself. Because if you're not flating yourself, then you're loathing yourself, and. We know what happens when we love ourselves. Yeah. What? Uh, we do things we, we later we away. do things we later regret, and then we find ourselves in a scandalous situation on the internet when someone decides to so like activate a um, a trap card. Well, either a trap card or some sort of like sexism like hashtag on Twitter, and like those sexism hashtags, man. Like they. Oh they God! Just, ah! oh, no, get out of there! Okay. That's it. I yeah. didn't find any of the law. I really just avoided. Come on, man. We'll find it Where later. Could it have been? No idea. Uh, probably underneath there, over there on the right. Where? Like way in the distance there on the right. Right there. Or was that where we started? I don't know where we started. Oh, uh, might have to come back. Ah, don't worry about law. I have to get all the law and then we'll go through a little run through yeah. before the last boss or something. Yeah. Because I like playing this game, so I don't mind doing that. Don't play a game. Game uh, bad. Uh, I'm playing a game right now. What? 
Why would you do that? Play a good game. Get out of here, Spago. 